Hello, Assalamu alaikum guys and welcome back to another video. It's Ibrahim Muslim and today I'm back with another exciting thing. So this is a video on something I named Airdrop 2.0. I named it Airdrop 2.0 because this is something equals to Airdrop but for android devices so there has been such a big issue such a big mess with android and mac you cannot properly transfer files using android file transfer there is such a hell of a problem doing so and you always get in some kind of a mess when you try to and the android file transfer is such a crap to be honest so this is the time to get rid of this android file transfer and you better just delete that application the god damn shitty application and switch to something i call airdrop 2.0 but in real the developer named it Handshaker. You might be using this application before this video. You might already know about that. But still, this application deserves to be reviewed. And it is highly underrated. Because I have been using Apple Mac from like years now. And it's been uh, like more than 2-3 years. And now at the end I got to know that this application exists. So the name of the application is Handshaker. And it is a real handshaker between Android and Apple OS X. So I hope the internet is fast enough to get us loaded. So the page is loaded and you can see this application is free. So let's open the application and here you can see install and you better click that button right away. So installing the handshaker will give you something which is way similar to your airdrop of your Apple devices or you can say MacBooks and iOS and stuff. So you can see the similar UI of this application and it is pretty small in size. It's like 10.2 MBs in size and let the application get installed. So as it is not a default or built-in application in Android, you have to install a counterpart or you can say a second part or an extended version of this application into your Android devices so the both applications can collab and they can give you a functionality which is way similar to AirDrop. So the application is now installed and we will click the open key and now you can see that it is displaying that current VLAN connection which is my Wi-Fi connection and to connect both of the devices there must be a Wi-Fi device or a USB connection. The Wi-Fi device on which the both mobile and the Mac or a MacBook Pro or an iMac should be connected for the software to work or collab with the Android devices. So what is the second step after this? So right now you can see that connect your phone computer to the same network and launch the handshake on your phone. But if you try to go on Play Store and if you try to search Handshaker, you will not be able to find any application there. I don't know why, why they did not provide it on App Store, but I think it's a pretty nice and excellent application to use. So let's go to the mobile screen and I will show you what you have to do after you connect your mobile to your system using a USB cable. So I've connected the USB cable to the computer and now I will connect the wire to my uh, device. This is a Huawei device and when I will connect it and the software, the Handshaker is is right now turned on on my Mac device so I will connect the phone and at the moment I connect the phone to the USB cable you can see that Handshaker wanted to make a connection with the mobile phone but it said there is no Handshaker application found on the phone to handle that protocol so what you will do is you will click on this view button and this will go to a link which is for the smart Asian and something and then it will give you a download link so after this there will be a downloading of uh, application which is handshaker.apk the size is quite small 495 4193 MB and once the file is downloaded you just click open and you just click install install so right now the application is being in installing and you will click open so now you can see the application is uh, installed in the phone and it says please launch the handshaker for your mac to establish the connection now we will shift to the our computer screen our mac screen and i will show you what you have to do after this so once you have connected the phone and the application is turned on onto your smartphone you will see this icon of your phone named here and this is almost like you see an icon on your airdrop area but this is for the handshaker and now we have installed the application on your smartphone phone and the application is open at the moment you can uh, later minimize it but right now you have to click on the device it can be of any name and then you have to click continue now for the first time the device will ask for the authorization and from your phone you have to click always once once or always depending on your choice 
and I will click always on my smartphone and after clicking the always it will open all the files and the folders which are available in my smartphone so this is quite latest and quite versatile it's not even available in airdrop that's why I said it's airdrop 2.0 for Android because in airdrop you can just send a file or receive a file if the mobile phone transfers it but if you are using the handshaker you can even copy a file from the smartphone directly onto your OS X and the speeds are quite high and you can also copy back or you can just send a file back to the smartphone as well like it's nothing and right now you can see the files are transferring over Wi-Fi not over USB cable or anything and right now you can here see it's connected on Wi-Fi this icon tells that the connection is Wi-Fi and this is the battery and the free storage of your smartphone so you can see the transfer rates are pretty well and you can even delete the files from here and just for reference I will send this file back to the smartphone and we we'll see the transfer rates which are like 700 and the transfer rates also depend on the modem you are using right now I'm using a mobile modem at the moment that's why the transfer rates are pretty low but if you're using something like a high quality modem the transfer rates will be like crazy high so this is all about the end airdrop 2.0 and i hope you like the video i hope this video will help you solve lots of your connection problems from your mac to an android device and you can get rid of this android file transfer which is a pretty pretty old application and due to the ignorance of android and apple for collaborating with each other so this application have just lifted up the connection status between both devices and i'm pretty thankful to the developers of the handshaker i think they are named as smart asians and something so that's all for this video guys if you have any question query please feel free to ask below and please like share and subscribe this video and follow me on facebook instagram and twitter i'm also trying to make a snapchat account and will upload videos on the work i'm doing nowadays it's been a long i've made a video but things get pretty messed up so that's why there was a delay so thanks again guys thanks for watching hope you liked it hope you enjoyed it and until the very next video please take care allah hafiz